Hi guys, so this video is going to explain a little bit about Chrome Music Lab. Um, I have included a link to this page on my on, below the video and in the initial post that I made on Google Classroom about this one. This video is going to look into these first two options um, on Chrome Music Lab. There are a lot of different things, um, but these two are the most um, buildable on for you. So the first one is called Song Maker. Um, once you click it and load it up. So there's this giant board of little blocks that you can make. Um, there's also, let me see if I can hide this. There we go. Um, there's also two different options for sounds. There are these dots as well. And then your speed, which is the higher the speed or the tempo, the faster it is. I'm gonna leave it at 120 for now, right around there. You can also type in and change it. So I'm gonna try 120. Um, and so with each of these blocks, they're all a different pitch from low to high. And then you can either have them on the beginning of the beat or on the second half of the beat. And then I can see how that sounds. So I'm, this is my marimba, marimba tone. If I like that melody, but I want to change the instrument, you just click. And I could play it on piano. I could do strings, um, woodwinds, or synth. And then I'm back to my rainbow. Now these bottom two, um, the the two rows of dots, are um, sort of like your snare drum, your and then your bass drum. So the snare drum is the top line, bass drum is the second line. So I could do. See how that sounds. Maybe I want to repeat that again. Let's finish it out. And then hear the whole thing. So it adds a little bit of a groove to it. Um, there's also blocks, um, which would ch just change these to a high block and a low block. Don't really like that one. Um, kit, so a more traditional snare drum and bass drum. Um, conga, so a high conga and low conga. And then we're back to electronics, so the electronic sounds. If you like your version, I'm going to move myself a little bit, um, you can save it and you can copy your link. And if you want to share it with the class, you could post that on Google Classroom or I'll create a little assignment to be able to share any of your creations that you would like to just with me. This next part of the video is about the rhythm part of um, Chrome Music Lab. A little simpler than the song maker. But it gives you so it gives you three rows of options for to pl to play along, and the instruments can change as well. So this one's two timpani and then a triangle. And it already sets you up with something. But maybe I want. So each row is a different instrument: the low timpani, the middle timpani, the high timpani, and then the triangle. But maybe I want to play around with some tom drum, snare drum, and hi-hat. And you don't have to keep with that rhythm. If you want to change it, you just click the dot to get rid of it. Let's try that. Pretty simple. Try a different one. So this one has claves and two wood blocks. And like, I like that this one loops so you can adjust as you go. This one doesn't have a share option, unfortunately, but you can just play around with some different rhythms. So there you go. And you might be able to create a rhythm here 
and then like you like it enough to utilize it in your other um, in the song maker obviously this has three options instead of two but you might find a rhythm that you like that you could play around with with a snare drum and kick drum in the song maker hopefully that gives you something to explore um, feel free to let me know if you have any questions and feel free to share any of your creations from the song maker <laughs>